This is your no bullshit guide to Androxus. Let's begin. Androxus is a flank champion who has a health pool of 2100 and whose auto attack does damage in the form of hitscan. His abilities are as followed. His base weapon, a semi-automatic revolver, does 520 damage every 0.36 seconds and has damage fall off. His ult fire is called Defiance which is essentially a punch that does 700 damage. His first ability is called Reversal. It absorbs all the shots in front and after 1.4 seconds for the projectile blast that does 75% of the damage absorbed. His second ability is Nether Step which arguably is his signature ability. Dash in any direction you face which can allow you to hover, hold spacebar to reduce full speed. His ultimate is called a cursed arm. Begin to fly for 4 seconds and your revolver now becomes a cannon which can fire 4 explosive blasts doing 1000 damage every 0.5 seconds. Androxus has 4 talents and they are as follows. Heads will roll, headshots deal an additional 50% damage and the revolver ammo capacity is increased by 2. Dark Stalker deal 20% more damage to enemies under 40% health. Defiant Fist Successful hits of Revolver increase the damage of your next Defiance hit by 10% up to a maximum of 100%. In Godslayer, Reversal now fires back and does a minimum of 800 damage. Here are 4 loadouts you get inspired by with each corresponding to a specific talent. Heads will roll, Abyss Walker 4, Slight of Hand 4, Equivalent Exchange 2, Through the Warp 3 and Quick Draw 2. Androxus doesn't have a bread and butter combo, well, more of that a bit later. It's namely just clever use of nether step and reversal. This loadout is a bit of jack of all traits because the talent is locked to your default weapon. Nether stepping will give you a bit health, ammo and dash a little bit further, heal a little bit each time you absorb your reversal and reload faster. Pretty simple. Darkstalker, Watchful 4, Buying Time 4, Elusive 3, Quick Door 2 and Through the Warp 2. This is the talent that enables your flanking role, if you may. Find the low health targets and finish them off. This means you need to move faster and further. Elusive makes you move faster after using other steps, and Watchful gives you a cooldown reduction for every elimination. Activating Reversal gives you ammo, and of course, you travel further in another step as well. Define Fest Marksman 3, Quick Draw 2, Slight of Hand 3, Abyss Walker 3, and Abyssal Touch 3. Honestly, this is a pretty niche talent, aka don't pick this because there are a lot of better options. But basically, you just shoot and after 10 shots, more or less swoop in and punch them. God Slayer Elusive 4, Seething Hatred 3, Abyss Walker 2, Power of the Abyss 4, Buying Time 2. Simple concept hit your shots, activate reversal. Try to hit your reversal and rinse and repeat. If you're under too much fire, use your nether steps. Easy and arguably the playstyle of Androxus that most Androxus main follow. The items are also pretty straightforward. The first item to be efficient at least would be at quarter eyes. Wrecker could work, but only on champions like Vivian, Khan, and Torvald. Quarter eyes is generally too valuable to give up. In the green items, kill to heal is king. Life rip can also work, but to maximize this, you need to hit those consistent headshots in addition to having heads will roll. For utility, morale boost is the best, as the cooldowns aren't long enough to warrant Kronos or cost. Low items can be decided on the situation of things. Androxus is a pretty popular champion in all of the ranks, so chances are people will know how to counter him. The best advice I can give you is to be unpredictable. You can dash, use reversal, and dash again. In the same dash range, your lowish health will relies on you not getting hit and you hitting your shots. Pick Andrew only after your core damage and support have been picked. I mean, you could think you can carry the game with him, but be honest with yourself. Team comps more often than not win the games, not the individual champions. There you go, no bullshit. Good luck and have fun. You can find me on Twitter at NinjaBuffin and I'll see you all in the room.